London. Today is Wednesday, February 15th. I'm Kaylee and this is NLS TV. Coming up today, we have our Wildcats of the Week, sports highlights, and weather and sports report with Wyatt. Today's lunch is pepperoni calzone or chicken nuggets. Thursday's is chicken Philly sub and Friday's will be sub sandwich. Happy birthday this week to Lillian, Luke, Micah, Xander, and Connor. Please don't wait until the last minute to see Mrs. Bone for scheduling. Next week, you will register for your classes and your papers will need to be signed and you will not have to meet with her by then. Attention sophomores and juniors, yearbook applications are due by the end of the day this Friday. No applications will be accepted after that day. Current CCP students, remember to get your letter of intent in for next year turned in. New CCP students, see Mrs. Bone for further instructions on how to take college classes for high school credit. Next, we have Wyatt with our sports report and weather. Thank you. Welcome back to sports. Thursday, February 16th, there's a varsity girls basketball tournament game at Shelby High School versus Mansfield St. Peter's at 715. And tickets for that game must be purchased online at ohsaa.org forward slash tickets. On Friday, February 17th, there was a JV and Varsity Boys basketball game at South Central at 6. And on Saturday, February 18th, there was a Girls Varsity Wrestling at Fredericktown at 10. And that is also the day of the Varsity Wrestling Conference meet at St. Paul starting at 10. That's all I got. Welcome back to weather. Today's weather is a high of 63, low of 46, and it's supposed to be windy. Thursday's weather is a high of 56, a low of 40, and it's supposed to be rainy, not rainy, stormy, with a 70% chance of rain. And, oh, storms, I should say. <laughs> On Friday, the high is 40, the low is 23, and this is also going to be windy. Thanks, Wyatt. Next, we have our Wildcats of the Week. What was your favorite game this season? It was definitely St. Peter's because it was the best game we played as a team. How can the team improve for next game? Um, we've been working on ironing out some issues that we've had with our offense, and we're just trying out some new things. We'll see how it works. What are the team goals? We're just trying to go into the postseason with a couple wins, and then um, we're playing for a sectional championship in our first game, which is awesome. Okay, thank you. Hi, I'm Caitlin, and I'm with Connor for Senior of the Week. Um, who was your favorite teacher throughout high school? Probably Mr. Kinsey. What was your favorite game in gym class? Definitely dodgeball. And what is your favorite part about school? If I can't go with leaving at 2.45, I guess I'll go to lunch. Okay, thank you. Hi, I'm Caitlin, and I'm with Ms. Haswell for Word of the Week. What is your word of the week? Technique. And what teacher would you like to pass it on to? Mrs. Trost. I'm here with uh, Coach Mitchell. How are you today? Good, guys. How are you guys doing? Good. Then how are you preparing for the upcoming tournament game? Um, now that the regular season's over, I told the girls, you know, everybody right now is zero and zero. So our uh, biggest thing is we have a game Thursday against Mansfield St. Pete. Um, they're not a real strong team, but I told the girls, I said, we can't look, overlook anybody right now in the tournament. So um, we'll do a lot more preparation for us for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and then hopefully if we can get that win Thursday to prepare us kind of with a rematch with Mansfield Christian, who actually was our very first game of the year and who beat us. So hopefully we can take care of business Thursday and get us to a rematch Saturday night against Mansfield Christian. And then how confident are you going into the tournament? Um, I, the team has the potential to do a lot of, have a lot of success. I mean, I think, you know, Thursday, we shouldn't have any problems. I'm not guaranteeing a victory, but you know, if we go in and take care of the things we need to take care of, it'll put us in a good situation to get to Saturday. Um, and again, Saturday, I like the growth we've made since the beginning of the season. So I think we have, we're capable of getting to a district tournament at Willard. So we got to go game at a time um, and just take care of business one game at a time and we'll see what happens. But I like our chances of, you know, making a little bit of a run. I'd love to get us to the district championship. Lynn, how does it feel to have beaten the previous school record? 
Um, you know, it's one of those, I've had a few people ask me newspapers. It, it, it's nice, but to me, I mean, you, you can talk to any other coaches in this school. It ain't about us. I mean, it's about you guys, you kids, and what you guys do and the success we have at New London, um, and you guys reaping the benefits, whether it's you as a wrestler or, or Timmy behind the camera there in basketball and just, or Corey in cross country. It's, it's about you kids and not, not us coaches. I mean, yeah, it's nice to have that, I guess, to fall back on when you're old. Um, but but really the success it comes from what you guys do on the on the mat on the court on the track on the course whatever it may be so you know I appreciate all the support and you know the the words of encouragement and everything but but overall it's just it's about New London and the kids here and what they do on the field thank you thanks guys make it a great day New London